So focus on the money. Your best customers buy a lot of stuff and they do it often. You want to get more of them, so do more of what you're doing right. Easy. Improve the outcomes. One baby's cute. Let's make more of them. Lots of them. Okay. Test your touch points. Change your selling touch points in your style. So if you're using Google, let's go see what happens if you send your ads to Yahoo and Bing and so on. Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, or Coot. Industry-specific social media sites. You want to send, um, you know, sell something to me? I'm on Wayne and Tripits and all of those social media sites that are in the travel vertical because I spend more time on the road than in my home. I'm the kind of person who carries a photo of my bed because you know, I want to make sure it's still there. Anyway, country-specific social media groups. Right. How many folks are doing international search? No, nope. most of you focusing right here in this. Okay, don't worry about it too much. But if you have ones specifically focused on India, going to do better. Okay, affiliates, paid and unpaid ambassadors. Concept of ambassadors is really hot stuff. Okay, you guys know about um, uh, what do you call it? Uh, ad, ad networks, right? I've got ads I want to get out there, I'm a company, so I go to the ad network and they, uh, ad server basically, right? And they say, okay, we'll take your ads and we're going to get it out there. And then they go to guys who have blogs and they say, uh, we want you to put text links in or then we want you to put the ad on your site or whatever it is, right? They're the go-between. Okay, now check this one out. You can say, all right, I want people to say good stuff about me in the social media site. And then you go to ho folks over here who have um, Facebook profiles with lots of folks who are listening to them and watching what they're doing and so on, and those are the key communicators. It's not the guy who follows 7,000 people and has 7,000 visitors. That's just a game, right? It's the guy who has seriously engaged people watching them on, on Facebook, who are talking to them on Facebook, who are connecting with them and actually engaging all right, in their river. That guy's powerful. Same thing with the Twitter. How many times the guy retweeted and how many people do follow him versus how many people do see follow and so on and so forth. You figure out what the metrics are on the, on the solid guys over there. And then this ad server company says, OK, you guys, you can become ambassadors. You can tweet nice things about Coca-Cola and you can get Coke products or whatever it is. OK, ambassadors, watch it. It's coming. Okay. Change your ads out. Change your target markets. OK, test your copy. So at this point, we're just changing target markets, your unique selling proposition. The images, okay. images are very, very interesting. Sex sells all over the world. So young females sell all over the world. So do babies' faces. Because as a human race, we root to babies' faces. We focus on them. It's survival of the species. So if you can't figure out how to use a young lady or a baby, figure out how to use at least another face. Faces make a whole lot of difference. Real ones, not clip art. Okay? Change your images out, change your color schemes. See what happens. What makes more money? Higher rankings in the SERPs? More images in the SERPs? YouTube videos? Compelling copy in your description tag? Did you know that, again, there's this average 55% of all those descriptive things that you find in the search engine result pages will convince you not to click through. So you spent all that time, effort, and money to either write your ad or to get in the first slot in the organic SERPs, and I'm still not clicking because you just talked me out of it. Be careful what you say there. Make sure that your description tags are all filled in and they're really good. Change them out now and then see what happens. Okay. How about more index pages? You've got this really great home page and maybe one landing page, but how about if you know 120 of your 132 pages were already, you know, were also indexed? How about if a million of your million point five pages were indexed? Would you sell more? Okay. Identify where the clog is for you in that sales funnel and clean it up. Okay. It might be that higher SERP rankings really do get you more visitors and more sales, but it might be that you keep selling on the YouTube video and you haven't really checked it out. Take a look for it. So clear these clogs.